What's going on guys? So now we have uh, three alkaline waters sitting right next to each other and we're gonna do a test to really showcase the alkalization power and how strong the alkalinity of each of these uh, waters will be, right? So Sydney, talk, talk to me a little bit about yeah. uh, the differences of waters between all three of these right here. Yeah, now the public, the consumers, they know that higher pH is better for your health, Absolutely. all right? Mm -hmm. So the higher the pH, the better. Mm -hmm. right, what they don't know yet, maybe some of them know, maybe not a lot of people knows yet. It's a very brand new thing that's coming into the marketing. Mm -hmm. And that uh, we are very happy to announce here yep. that when you have like three, three types of water, you have a bottled water essential, that's a, a big brand here in the US. Mm -hmm. Everybody yep. knows essential, the pH over nine. Yep. This is the candy water. Okay, yep. Kangen water, so mm -hmm. it's like around 9.5. Yep, of the K8 uh, okay. that we have over there. All right, yeah. all right. And this comes from the V line. It's a new formula, new way of doing alkaline water. What's mm -hmm. the difference in between these two? Mm -hmm. Pretty much they are the same, okay? okay. Uh, what about this one here? This has one thing called negative PRAW. PRAW mm -hmm. stands for potential renal acid load. What it does is it, uh, uh, the water is still alkaline water, but has more alkalinity. Alkalinity is different than alkaline. Alkaline is anything that has pH over 7. Mm -hmm. It's alkaline. Yeah. So what, what the water, alkaline water with alkalinity? Mm -hmm. does different in your system yeah fights back uh, acidic environment let's say you have an environment of acidic mm -hmm. so when you have your body as too acidic you are creating environment for diseases okay mm -hmm. Absolutely. so you have to turn that around to mm -hmm. turn that around you not only need high pH you need strong uh, alkalinity okay. that makes the whole difference if you are buying uh, alkaline water paying top dollars for it and doesn't have prow, you might be losing the greatest benefit you should be, you are looking for. Okay, mm -hmm. so what we're gonna do here, we're gonna go ahead sure. and pour a little bit of the water into the cup. So into the glass, you can see the difference. Let's say a uh, little bit less than half okay. of a glass. This is still locked. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go ahead and do the same here. Right about the same, right? Thank you. Oh, yeah, yeah it uh, needs to be the same, to be fair, um, with our beloved friends over there. Okay. Is that about the same? All right. So, I have a pH test drops over here. Okay. When it goes, when it goes purple, mm -hmm. so this is just funny. Okay. We have a whole range of colors. Mm -hmm. Okay. Red wishes, yellow wishes, green wishes, blue wishes, and goes all the way to the purple wishes. Okay, yeah. so uh, yellows and, and and reds, you don't want that. Okay, yeah, that's acidic. You want you want from the the dark green up, mm -hmm. dark green, light blue, dark blue, light purple, and dark purple. So yeah. when you when you put this in, this is gonna happen. See, yeah. quickly turning into into purple. That means that it's very high pH in, in those water. This as well, see? It doesn't matter how much you pour, it doesn't matter because it only makes it strong, never change the color, mm -hmm. see? You can put a fair amount of here. Sure. Okay, go. So, um, you can you can tell by the colors, they are all great waters over here. Absolutely, yeah. Um, you know, all purple. Mm -hmm. it, the range between nine and 10. Probably mm -hmm. this is gonna be 10 because it's a little dark and light uh, mm -hmm. purple. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pretend I'm gonna create an, an uh, acidic environment. Yep, Let's similar say, to our stomach. Yeah, so I have uh, some acid over here. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and put one drop each at the time and see how they're gonna fight back the acidic, okay? Okay. So this is first one here, one, mm -hmm. another one over here, and another one over here. Okay, okay. let's go, this goes back here. You can stir that for me. Okay, you see, okay. this is what I'm talking about. This mm -hmm. was never done before mm -hmm. in the whole history of the America. Yeah. So this is the uh, weakest one. Mm -hmm, it exactly. has high pH to it, mm -hmm. okay, but it, it loses its, al uh, its power to mm -hmm. really transform acidic environment into alkaline environment mm -hmm. instantly, okay? okay. This already became blue, so mm -hmm. the pH went from like nine and a half to eight and a half. Mm -hmm. And this, not even blank. Okay. So we're gonna go and we're gonna do a second round. Sure. Um, oh, listen, one here. There. You can do that one too. One here. 
and one over here. Okay? Look at that. So, from this point on, mm -hmm. none of those water are actually changing anything inside of your body. Yep. They're still good to, you know, uh, to hydrate you a little, mm -hmm. right? To do a little cleansing. Yes, yeah, it's but better than uh, it's better than the regular water. tap water. Yeah, mm -hmm. but you're not getting anything behind that. Besides that, okay? Mm -hmm. Look at that. It's still not didn't even change to the blue because when you change from purple to blue to dark green, you are still having some benefits when we're mm -hmm. talking about transforming acidic environment into alkaline environment. Yeah, you know when you're born, you are alkaline environment. You are mm -hmm. alkaline inside. Yeah. As you get older, two things happen fast. You mm -hmm. lose water, and the water you keep, you keep it's acidic. Mm -hmm. So that's why it's easier to get sick mm -hmm. and older age than at a younger age. Gotcha. That's why uh, this is like cancer, okay? Mm -hmm. They easily get older people than the younger people. So yep. if you want to reverse that, mm -hmm. you got to go travel back and then time towards the condition you had when you were a baby. Which is alkaline. You are more water than anything else. 30% mm -hmm. of you is you. The rest is water. So if you change that water into this type of water, mm -hmm. you, you, you know, you walk in large pace towards a health condition mm -hmm. where it's going to be easier to be health and very hard to get sick. Gotcha. Do you want to do another round? Yeah, let's do another round. Let's yeah. see where it goes. Start that for me, please. Sure. Yeah. So it still holds up. Yeah, it still holds up. And it's gonna keep kept going, kept going. So that's it, man. That's the difference between alkaline, high pH waters. Mm -hmm. They are not the same. This is brand new. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is an opportunity to know something new today. Absolutely. Right? So, guys, I hope that you learn a little more about alkalinity and the differences of alkaline uh, waters and which one you really should be hydrating yourself with to actually have the superior benefit for your body as Sydney explained here. All right. All right. Talk to you guys soon.